Here are 30 most commonly asked skull-related interview questions in e-commerce company interviews, along with detailed answers. 1. What is the role of skull in an e-commerce company? Answer. Skull is crucial in an e-commerce company for managing and querying databases. It is used to retrieve product information, process transactions, track customer orders, and analyze sales data. 2. How can you retrieve a list of products with their prices and availability status from the database? Answer. To retrieve product information, you can use a select statement. Select product name, price, availability from products. 3. Explain the importance of indexes in the context of an e-commerce database. Answer. Indexes improve query performance by allowing faster data retrieval. In e-commerce, indexes on product IDs, customer IDs, and order IDs can significantly enhance the speed of searches. 4. How do you calculate the total sales for a specific product category in the last month? Answer. Use a query with date filtering and aggregation. Select product to category, some price quantity as total sales from orders. Where order date equals date add month minus one. Lot date group by product to category. Five. Discuss the use of transactions in e-commerce databases. Answer. Transactions ensure data consistency during operations like order processing. For example, when deducting items from inventory and updating the order status. These operations should be part of a transaction to maintain data integrity. 6. How can you prevent skull injection in an e-commerce application? Answer. Use parameterized queries or prepared statements to sanitize inputs. Avoid concatenating user inputs directly into skull statements to prevent skull injection attacks. 7. Explain the concept of acid properties in the context of e-commerce transactions. Answer. Acid properties atomicity, consistency, isolation, durability. Ensure that e-commerce transactions are treated as indivisible units, maintaining data integrity and reliability. 8. What are common challenges in managing user sessions in an e-commerce database, and how can you address them with Skull? Answer. Challenges include handling concurrent sessions and managing session data. Skull can be used to design efficient session tables, track user activity, and implement session expiration policies. 9. How do you design a database schema to handle product variations such as size and color? Answer. Use a normalized schema with tables for products, variations, and inventory. Employ foreign keys to establish relationships and enable efficient querying based on size and color attributes. 10. Discuss the role of triggers in an e-commerce database. Answer. Triggers can be used to automate actions, such as updating inventory levels. When an order is placed or sending notifications for low stock, they ensure timely responses to database events. 11. How do you optimize skull queries for product searches on an e-commerce website? Answer. Optimization involves using indexes, avoiding select queries, and optimizing join operations. Additionally, employing catching mechanisms for frequently searched products can enhance performance. 12. Explain the concept of denormalization in the context of e-commerce databases. Answer. Denormalization involves duplicating data to reduce the need for join operations and improve query performance. It is useful for read-heavy scenarios, such as product catalog displays. 13. How can you design a database to handle customer reviews and ratings for products? Answer. Create tables for customers, products, reviews, and ratings. Use foreign keys to establish relationships enabling efficient querying and analysis of customer feedback. 14. Discuss the importance of data backups and recovery strategies in e-commerce databases. Answer. Regular backups are crucial for data recovery in case of system failures or data corruption. Implementing backup strategies, such as full and incremental backups, is essential for e-commerce data protection. 
15. How can you identify and remove duplicate entries in the customer database? Answer. Use a query with the group by clause to identify duplicates and delete or update statements. To remove or merge duplicate entries based on specific criteria. 16. Explain the use of stored procedures in an e-commerce database. Answer. Stored procedures encapsulate skull code for reuse. In e-commerce, they can be used for complex operations like order processing, payment validation, and inventory updates, enhancing modularity and security. 17. How would you handle a sudden surge in website traffic impacting the database performance? Answer. Strategies include scaling the database infrastructure, optimizing queries, and implementing catching mechanisms. Load balancing and cloud-based solutions can help distribute traffic efficiently. 18. How do you design a schema for tracking abandoned shopping carts? Answer. Create tables for customers, carts, and products. Use foreign keys and timestamps to track cart abandonment and implement automated processes to handle cleanup and notifications. 19. Discuss the use of materialized views in an e-commerce database. Answer. Materialized views store pre-computed results of queries. Improving query performance for frequently accessed data, such as top-selling products or popular categories. 20. How can you implement security measures to protect customer data in an e-commerce database? Answer. Employ encryption for sensitive data, implement access controls, and regularly audit user permissions. Regularly update security protocols and educate staff on best practices to safeguard customer information. 21. How would you handle a scenario where a customer wants to cancel an order after payment? Answer. Implement a cancellation process that verifies the order status, refunds the payment, and updates the order status accordingly. Ensure data consistency and maintain an audit trail for financial transactions. 22. Explain the role of skull views in an e-commerce database. Answer. Skull views provide a virtual representation of data based on select queries. They can simplify complex queries, restrict access to sensitive information, and enhance data abstraction in e-commerce databases. 23. How can you optimize skull queries for reporting purposes in an e-commerce company? Answer. Optimization involves using appropriate indexes, aggregations, and tuning the database for reporting workloads. Materialized views and denormalization may be considered for complex reporting requirements. 24. Discuss the importance of foreign key constraints in maintaining data integrity in an e-commerce database. Answer. Foreign key constraints enforce referential integrity, ensuring that relationships between tables are maintained. They prevent actions that would result in orphan or inconsistent data. 25. How can you implement a recommendation engine for suggesting products to customers based on their purchase history? Answer. Use collaborative filtering algorithms or skull queries that analyze customer purchase patterns. Join customer and product tables to recommend products based on similar customers' preferences. 26. Explain the use of database indexes in an e-commerce company and their impact on performance. Answer. Indexes improve query performance by allowing faster data retrieval. In an e-commerce database, indexes on product IDs, customer IDs, and order IDs can significantly enhance the speed of searches. 27. How do you handle and store images or multimedia content associated with products in an e-commerce database? Answer. Store multimedia content in a separate file system or use specialized databases for binary data. Use references or paths in the database to link products to their associated multimedia files. 28. Discuss the role of skull constraints in maintaining data quality in an e-commerce database. Answer. Constraints like not null, unique, and check are essential for maintaining data quality and consistency. They enforce rules that prevent invalid or incomplete data entries. 29. 
How would you design a schema for handling internationalization and multiple languages in an e-commerce database? Answer, create tables for products, categories, and content with language-specific columns. Use foreign keys to maintain relationships between language-independent and language-dependent data. 30. Explain the impact of database normalization on e-commerce database performance and maintenance. Answer, normalization reduces data redundancy, but may involve more join operations. In an e-commerce context, striking a balance between normalization and denormalization is crucial to optimize performance and ease maintenance. These skull-related interview questions cover various aspects of database management and optimization in the context of an e-commerce company. Adapt the responses based on the specific technologies and skull dialects used in your organization. For more exciting tips, tricks and more importantly, for valuable insights of interviews, please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. It has a lot of valuable information about various insights of interviews. It has a wide range of real-world portfolio projects of various technologies for interviews, and it has wide range of most asked interview questions and answers of various technologies like data science, SAP, AWS, DevOps, and full-stack web development, and more. That will be useful during interviews. It has a wide range of most asked interview questions and answers, and real-world portfolio projects of various technologies for freshers. For two to three years, experienced candidates, and for five or above years, experienced candidates to test their skills by knowing most. Ask interview questions and make themselves ready for interviews.